Tarantulas have fascinated people for centuries with their large-sized hairy bodies and often misunderstood behavior. Among the many tarantula species, the desert tarantula Aphonopelma prentishi stands out as a unique inhabitant of the arid landscapes of the American Southwest. This species may not be as vividly colored as some tropical varieties, but its adaptations, lifestyle, and ecological role make it truly special. Afonopoma printici is native to the desert regions of Southern California and parts of the surrounding states. Unlike rainforest tarantulas that thrive in humid environments, the desert tarantula has adapted to survive in harsh, dry conditions where daytime temperatures can soar and water is scarce. Its natural habitat includes sandy or rocky soils, desert scrublands, and open grasslands, where it can dig burrows for shelter and temperature regulation. One of the most remarkable features of the desert tarantula is its burrowing ability. These spiders construct deep burrows, sometimes more than a foot underground, to escape the intense desert heat and to conserve moisture. The burrow serves as a safe retreat from predators and as a base from which the spider hunts. The entrance of the burrow is often lined with silk, which helps the tarantula detect vibrations from approaching prey or threats. This silk lining also prevents the burrow from collapsing in loose soil. Desert tarantulas are nocturnal, meaning they are most active at night. This behavior helps them avoid the searing desert sun. During the day, they stay inside their burrows where temperatures are much cooler and humidity is higher than outside. At night, they emerge to hunt for insects, small lizards, and other invertebrates. Their metabolism and hunting strategies are adapted to conserve energy in an environment where prey can be scarce. While Afonopoma prontechi is not among the largest tarantulas in the world, it is still an impressive spider. Adults typically have a leg span of about 4 to 5 inches, 10 to 13 centimeters, with a sturdy, hairy body that ranges in color from dark brown to light tan. Its coloration blends perfectly with the desert environment, providing camouflage against predators such as birds, reptiles, and mammals. One of the most fascinating aspects of desert tarantulas is their longevity. Female Afana Pelma Prentechi can live for 20 years or more, while males typically live only 5 to 10 years. This long lifespan allows females to produce many egg sacs over their lifetime, ensuring the survival of the species in a challenging environment. Despite their intimidating appearance, desert tarantulas are generally non-aggressive toward humans. They prefer to retreat rather than bite, and their venom is relatively mild, similar in potency to a bee sting for most people. When threatened, they may rear up on their hind legs to display their fangs or flick urticating hairs from their abdomen, which can irritate skin and eyes. However, these behaviors are defensive rather than offensive. In the desert, seasonal patterns greatly influence the tarantula's behavior. Most of the year, they remain in their burrows. However, during the late summer and early fall, mature males leave their burrows to search for females. This mating season often coincides with cooler temperatures and increased insect activity. This is also when people are most likely to see desert tarantulas in the wild, as wandering males may cross roads or appear in backyards. Desert tarantulas play a key role in controlling insect and small animal populations. By preying on crickets, beetles, grasshoppers, and other arthropods, they help maintain a balance in the ecosystem. Additionally, their abandoned burrows can provide shelter for other desert animals, such as lizards, snakes, and small mammals, making them important contributors to the desert habitat. While Afonopelma prentechi is not currently considered endangered, it does face threats from habitat destruction, urban development, and pesticide use. Overcollection for the exotic pet trade can also pose risks to wild populations. Protecting their habitat and promoting responsible tarantula keeping practices are important for ensuring their continued survival in the wild. For tarantula enthusiasts, the desert tarantula offers a hardy, low maintenance species to keep in captivity. Their ability to adapt to drier environments makes them easier to care for than tropical species that require constant humidity control. However, they are not particularly flashy in coloration, so they are often valued more for their behavior and hardiness than for their appearance. The desert tarantula, Afanopelma prentici, may not have the bright colors of rainforest species, but it is a marvel of adaptation. From its skillful burrowing habits to its ability to endure extreme desert conditions, this spider is perfectly suited to its environment. Its gentle demeanor, ecological importance, and unique life history make it a fascinating subject for both nature lovers and arachnid enthusiasts. In a world where desert survival requires specialized adaptations, 
Afanapella Prentici stands out as a patient predator, a master of underground engineering, and a quiet yet vital player in the delicate balance of the desert ecosystem.